How's it going everyone? Hopefully you're doing well. Welcome back to The Grind. And uh, as you probably know, it's Wednesday, so therefore we have the credit grind. So without further ado, let us begin the grinding. Alright, so here we are on good old Redshire. Very nice. Redshire, whatever you want to, however you want to pronounce it. It's so weird how different people pronounce stuff, isn't it? Like, because if you, obviously in England we have Yorkshire. And I've probably, I've probably said this before, but like we have Yorkshire, um, and m most of the, the towns and places are sheer, like it's not shire. So, uh, interesting to know how exactly that's meant to be pronounced. Either way, we're going to go to the heavy corner because tier 8 game, no RT. Hopefully we can actually have some fun. Apologies there wasn't a video yesterday. Um, I really didn't feel like it. And I don't mean that as in like I just didn't want to make a video. I, I mean yes there is partly that but I just woke up and didn't feel good. And yeah. I'm not going to force myself to make a video if I don't really feel it because it's just not. You need the videos to be you know entertaining and fun. Um, and it's just not. You just don't want. Oh. Uh, Hello, you know, it just doesn't really work, does it? Easy bounce. Okay, nice 3A is over there as well. IS 3A? Wait, where's the IS 3A? Borsig can't pen me from this angle. It's actually insane that the IS-3A didn't get detected when he shot. To be quite honest with you, I'm quite happy just to sit here and just keep absorbing his shells because he's not actually going to do anything to me. We'll just wait a little bit. We don't need to put, uh, kind of force the aggression here. We'll wait. Wait for the... Uh, of course he's going to kill him. That's a bit unlucky. Lover killed him. Try and get back before the Borsig shoots again. The Borsig isn't a fast tank, so I'm just going to wait until he's unspotted. Until I'm unspotted, sorry. He can't escape. Like, he's still going to be around here somewhere. In fact, he's just fired. Chances are he's, like, there. Maybe we hit him, maybe we didn't. Guess we'll find out after that game. I'm not going to sit here. We'll burn our repair kit now and try and get out of here because this is not going to be a winning kind of situation. Um, this guy's pushing, which is great, but he's on 121 health. So, what are we going to do? Um, what else is at the back? We haven't been hit by anything else, so I don't actually know if there's anything else with the Vorsig in the back there. But we can just wait here for a little bit and just find out what's going on. It's a bit annoying that the other heavies didn't come this side and they all went the other side. Um, my tank's a bit too slow to actually go back. So I can't really rotate around. Oh, hello. Nice. We didn't get detected, which is good. Don't really have a reliable pen on him. Can shoot this, though. Yeah, this isn't a bad idea. The only downside is obviously Borsig, who is at the back over there somewhere. Um, we can actually use this rock though to our advantage, so everything is not completely lost. Just keep going back though. The last thing we want to do is get stuck here. Let's see if we can bait this guy. 
A Capullo's on the right hand side, so that's pretty well hidden. Uh, is... that guy is not. Okay, well we're going to have to go and fight this lover then. Did I track him? He's not got the normal lava hit points, so... This side is a lot more safer than the other side, even though that I'm exposing my capola. Um, really? Well, it's not a lot safer if a Barask is allowed to just sit there. He did not use this repair kit. But now he has. I thought the T1 was going to come all the way down, but he didn't. Oh well. Um, ah, our team just flopped. <laughs> Nothing you can do about it. Um, we won our side of the map, but we couldn't really push because we didn't have enough people. And the other side didn't win. So, yeah. Not a lot you can do. Okay, so we come top on damage, which is actually kind of surprising, to be honest. Like 1.8k is not that much. There's just nothing you can do in those types of games, unfortunately. Uh, we did earn 116k, but we earned 70k from a mission as well, so keep that in mind. Uh, but yeah, besides that, it wasn't a bad game. Obviously, it would have been nice to win, but overall, it's fine. On to the next game. Right. Again, kind of similar matchup to what we had last game. Getting quite lucky in not having artillery. Yeah, I will go up. I will go up this time. Um, usually I like to not play up on this map because... I don't know, you just... If you spawn from this side, you're just at a massive disadvantage. Because they'll get here, and by the time that they get here, you're crossing, and then you just die. But we'll see what we can do. Hopefully, um we can get into the middle. Because without Artie in the middle is really, really nice. No, there they are. That was good. That's actually really good that we managed to hit him. And we bounced him. Good. Good. Very nice. Very good start so far. Um... Okay, no, I can't actually cross this. Now I can, because they're going to be preoccupied with the ISM. At least they should be. Okay. We took, what, two shots? But that's okay. All in all. We're um, still up on health, so that's fine. There are a lot of TDs that we need to watch out for. So obviously there's a Prochetto that's coming around here and he can spot us when we were going up to like this. Um, but we also have every single TD is probably just going to be camped at the back here. Which is going to be really, really annoying. That went in. I don't know who I hit, but that one went in. That one didn't. We need to also be very, very careful because they are higher than us. So when they're higher than us, this armor is going to be very, very easy to defend. Because although it's sloped uh, kind of, you know, downwards, obviously if they're above us, that's just going to be completely flat. kind of want to go up here. But the LT-432 doesn't really have that much um, gun depression. And I might be able to kill this lava actually. All he has to do is just go forwards. Very nice. The light tank killed him though. Very 
weird. I don't know why he peaked that on 44 health. Even if he didn't think he was spotted, he shouldn't have been peeking that. I think we hit that. I'm not sure. Very, very nice. He's dead. See you later, buddy. Another one in. See, we could be shooting the WZ. And if we're shooting the WZ, it's like a 50-50 whether or not I pen. But obviously nothing shot back at us yet, so we don't know what exactly we are even shooting at. And I really don't want to be sitting here out in the open for too long, that's why I'm rushing these shots. That Progesto is very low on health now, so we don't really have to worry about him, he's dead. Once his AMX is dead, then I can actually move up, um, further up the hill, and then hopefully we can actually get some uh, shots on the TDs at the back. But we should actually be able to do it now, because this guy won't swap me. I am conscious also of the fact that there could be a TD that's sitting right in the base. Where art thou TDs? I reckon they've moved. We're going to make the bold decision. Probably very stupid. But the bold decision of uh, just YOLOing forwards. I'm sure this will work. Because I think that the majority of the TDs are actually just going to be either down here or... They're at the back. Ooh, okay. Wasn't expecting that. <clears throat> Scorpion G still hasn't been spotted. The Scorpion G is either at the back here or he's dropped down with the boar signal. And it doesn't look like he dropped down. So I'm guessing he's going to be at the back. Or he could be at the back there. Who knows? We're about to find out. Oh, there he is. Really? Alright, let's just keep going forward. Maybe we can get one more shot into this lava. Where did that go? Game? Are we good? Okay. Not uh, not a great game uh, for marks wise, but it's okay. At least we gained some credits out of it. Alright, so 1.4k. Yes, we did hit this guy blind once. Uh, knocked out his track, apparently. Okay. Uh, so yeah, not not a great game, honestly. But for Cliff, in a slow tank like that, it's good enough. I mean, I say slow. Like, it is slow compared to most others. Um, so, yeah, we're not doing too badly. Um, overall, our DPG is like 2.1. It's awful, but it's okay. And so far, the games haven't really been going our way, but we have earned 172k credits. So... I'm not too worried about that. Uh, yeah. Slowly making our way. We should. We actually nearly have enough to, I think, outright buy the um, the Batcher. Right? Oh, yeah, we do. We could just buy it. Okay. I mean, we'll, we'll end up selling the 1375 anyway, but it's besides the point. Anyway, we're getting sidetracked. On to the third game. Okay, so. Hmm. Where, where am I going to go? I mean, I guess I'll just go to the hill and just hope for the best. The problem being that I would like to go over here, but as soon as I meet any of the tier 10s, they can just pair me easily. Don't have to be loading premium rounds. Um, so we have that problem to kind of deal with. So I guess we try and try and shoot some of the medium tanks that are going up onto the hill because then at least we can actually get something out of the game. 
yeah, we'll have to see how this goes. I don't have high hopes for this. I mean, we have a chief here. And he's got field mods. Come on. He's got field mods. He hasn't got any marks. And he hasn't really even got a camo. That's not what you want to see. He's not playing it very very smart, but... Okay. I might be able to wedge myself up into here. Hopefully. Yeah, okay. This is... It's an interesting play from the lover. Okay, I'm I'm just gonna say it. This chief is not a good player. Unlucky. There's nothing we can do. It, it's just such a 50-50. It's like, oh, well, you might pen it. Who knows? Let's see if we can actually track this guy again. That was a good shot. What the hell just hit him? No, uh, we're not going to repair our um, repair. You know what I mean. We're not going to heal our radio man. He's useless. Don't worry about him. I, don't, I have no idea what this chief's doing. Well played. You just lost a thousand of your hit points for no reason. Very, very good. We're losing this game by the looks of things at the moment, so... Yeah, we're just going to have to wait. Just me, did that go nowhere close to where I actually aimed that? I really do wish this gun was a little bit more accurate. Oh, I love just seeing here not being able to do anything. It's great. Why are they pushing? I don't. I don't understand this. Why? I mean, well done. You managed to kill them, but you just lose all your health for no reason. And we're already losing the game. Like. you high roll because why wouldn't you uh, I don't know nothing I can do in the tier 10 game doesn't matter what tank you're in well we lost big surprise there right um, chief done okay uh, he's not like a great player but you know Jesus okay he's a lot of games um, yeah, he's not a great player, and like you could see by some of the stuff he was doing, but whatever. I don't really care. Um, yeah, he's not the reason why we lost, in all fairness. Like, the other the other side of the map just fell apart, so yeah. I mean, I didn't play great, I won't lie, but I am not going to... The thing is, it was a lover, and like a phase one, I can't pen if he's hold down at all, because um, his capola is doesn't even work. Uh, it'd be nice if the phase one capoda actually did was a weak spot, but you know, no, it's uh, it's not. Uh, so yeah. Oh well, tier eights against tier tens and uh, nines. Very fun. Right, we are going to go to the right. Get Abby tier six, one RT, not too bad. Albeit it is an M forty four, so yeah, have the privilege of getting spammed by that thing. That's going to be fun. 
but hopefully we don't get focused too much by artillery. And we should just be able to just stomp down here and see what we can do. Right. A few shots uh, going out at the Skoda. There we go. Hello. I'll fire one. Why not? Mm, nobody's gone to the middle, which is worrying. Okay, from this position, this is actually really, really good. Because you can go hold down, sort of. That was a lucky shot, actually. <laughs> Didn't expect that to hit. Uh, Super Hellcat's like in one of these bushes over here. Down there. Although that's an easier shot to hit. We even get the spotting on the Tiger, which is really good. Found the Super Hellcat. this trigonometry this man has performed on me. That's from the base. Right. It's safe to say that we can just ignore the E25 because he's basically useless down there. The IS-2S is a bit of a problem. We might be able to get a shot off on him. Just wait. This is the reason why I didn't go forwards. Because he'll be waiting there. Now he can go forwards. He's spotted. He's going to back off. He's not going to pick that twice. At least he shouldn't do. Knowing World of Tanks players, I don't trust it. He's going to peek it twice. Oh, no, he's not. He's kind of just sitting there waiting. But we should be safe here. And we put one into the charioteer and back off. Be very, very annoying. You know what? We can actually push this. Our armor should hold up. Yep. Charioteer will cause us issues. But the Tiger won. He's going to have to fire gold if he wants to go through me. Unless he hits the Cabola. Nice. Just be patient. Okay, now we can go forwards and hopefully get one more shot in because the Hellcat's going to shoot him once at least. And he shot him as well. MC... F Sir? Are you okay? It's annoying that I can't really... Uh track him because I've already got spotting damage so it wouldn't really matter okay well at least that that game ended a lot better than uh, the last few all right so that game was a lot better than the last ones well definitely a lot better than the last ones uh, yeah I'm happy that we finally got a good game in the end um, we got Top Gun which I didn't even realize that we got um, do we actually get six skills? Oh. There you go. I was just so focused on just getting damage. Like, it just happens. Um, we got 30k from a mission for the battle pass and 140k in profit. So that means overall in this session, 
we got 338k. Now that over four games without a premium account and just running normal kind of credit boosters, we got a clan booster on as well. Um, quick shout out to the clan if you do want to join, then you can. Uh, we'll run a credit booster every day, usually in, in the evening. So if you want to join Union Can, it is EU only, but I can't do anything about that. But yeah, I'm happy with the result. So thank you very much for watching another video. If you did enjoy, then make sure to leave a like and subscribe as it does all help me out greatly. And uh, yeah, leave a comment down below of uh, what your favorite premium tank is. We'll do that today. What is your favorite premium tank? Whether you, you know, you might not have had any premium tanks, but you want to get one in the future, maybe, or you think that that is the best and, you know, even though that you don't have it, you would want it. So, uh, yeah, let me know. As always, thank you very much for watching. I'll see you all in the next one.